A live look at San Jose now. Officers have eased up on parking enforcement in the city during much of the pandemic, but that break is over now. KPIX 5's Len Ramirez with the new tools making it easier for officers to write tickets. Well, this is the type of parking situation we're talking about. This neighborhood doesn't have any parking meters on the sidewalk, just a sign above the parking spaces that says two hours of parking any day. In the past, it was hard for enforcement teams to be able to spot violators, but now because of some new technology that uses license plate readers, those days are a thing of the past. And yes, it probably means that the city will be writing more parking tickets. The dreaded parking ticket is making a comeback in neighborhoods all over San Jose. This van got slapped with a citation as the city returns to pre-pandemic enforcement actions. We're returning to normal as far as time-restricted parking, but with a twist, we've had this time to modernize our program. Parking enforcement vehicles are now equipped with multiple license plate readers. As enforcement cars make their rounds, officers will get a ping if the camera spot a car that the system recognizes as having been parked in the same spot for too long. The city has almost 700 time-restricted parking spaces, ranging from 12 minutes to four hours. Right now, we're going to start enforcing 274 of these areas, so areas that have a time limit of less than two hours. I think they should spend more money on doing other things other than trying to give somebody a ticket. Alberto grew up in San Jose and today his classic Monte Carlo was parked in a 30 minute zone as he enjoyed a meal at a downtown restaurant. He questioned the need for increased enforcement. They might lose track of time. You know, if it's 30 or 40 minutes, I mean, why give me a ticket? You know, I'm enjoying my dinner. One of the other complaints has been over privacy since the cameras are always recording the license plates and whereabouts of vehicles, even those not in violation of anything. We don't take a picture of your license plate, for instance, and compare it to any other list. And the city says the vehicles do a data purge of unused images every day. Besides time-restricted zones, the technology will help spot cars illegally parked in neighborhoods that are permitted for residents only. In San Jose, Len Ramirez, KPIX 5.